Hello, my name is Simon Gisler, and I am a senior from Gretna. We hear you! This is called Stand Straight. When I was five, I thought you were the coolest. Kids had asked me who my favorite superheroes were, and I'd say, Batman, Spider-Man, Superman, Dad. You were that cool. You'd lift me up on your shoulders, carry me around, and I'd swear we were a hundred feet tall, flying over the world and all its little people, like explorers of the jungle gyms, like champions of the swing sets, like heroes. And I never worried about tomorrow, because I could always count on Super Dad to save the day. And for 10 years, you did. So I didn't notice when you started coming home late on heavy leaden feet, only to flop out on your bed too tired to mutter goodnight. I didn't realize that you, who used to scale tall buildings in a single bound, were starting to walk with a hunch. And I wasn't scared for an instant when on January 1st you sat us all down and told us that you'd been laid off. Happy New Year. It's okay, you said. I'll fix this right away. Well, right away has come and gone because that was two years, four months, and seven days ago, and now I'm terrified. Trembling in my bones, I wonder whether or not I get to try out for the school play. Because I know that every hour that I waste memorizing lines can be spent flipping burgers for scratch instead. I hadn't realized that for you, unemployment would be kryptonite. Because nowadays, that we used to share slaying dragons and digging for treasure are spent worlds apart as you while away your mundane life, reorganizing the kitchen cupboard for the 22nd time and drowning in the seasons of shows that you say you have time for now because nobody pays what your people used to anyway. As your mind slipped like the smile from your face, so did my respect for you, the guy who was once superior to the Man of Steel and more daring than the Dark Knight. I once would have given anything to be your sidekick, but now I cannot so much as hear you ask me to take out the trash without wanting to reply, do it yourself! Kapow. Because you have become someone who I, for the first time in my life, can't count on to save the day. To accept less over nothing for the sake of the people you love. But you do love me. I know because even when I won't say it back, you say that you love me. Even though I've spent the past two years, four months, and seven days ashamed to be your son, you say that you love me. And maybe I'm naive, or maybe I just want to trust in heroes again. But I believe you. I believe that you'll put on your red cape and stand straight again. That's why today when somebody asks me who my favorite superheroes are, I still say, Batman. Superman, Spider-Man,